Yo, they twins, boy. They twins, bro. God, Just the man twins. I've been waiting for. Oh, hey, I, I'm. <laughs> I know who you are. Blessed. That's my job. But you don't know me yet. I'm Andy Kisner, director of player personnel. Oh, nice to meet you, Andy. Likewise. We're really happy to have you in the building. Hey, look. Mama was blessed. She had two twins that turned out to be NFL players, man. Hey, we just had the Texans here, man. Let's go, man. Let's get right. Wait, hold on. I gotta do something to make him look different. I gotta get the dark jaw for him. Uh huh. You gonna have a Nike, Nike, and for the shoes, for the shoes you gonna write these. Oh snap! These are my cleats that I got in real life. That's tough. I didn't know that. All right, so that's what you gonna do. We gonna do. I forgot we gotta do the first try first. Yo, what's up, Sosa? Hey, man. Just wanted to check in with you. How are you feeling? Excited to get to work? Yeah, yeah man. Fresh start's gonna be nice, but I'm ready to get yeah, to man, it. You got a wrong. golden Let's opportunity, go, too. You might be a one-year deal, but they're gonna give you plenty of chances to prove it. You gotta be ready to take it and run with it. Man, Come on, Sosa. Start. You've known me long enough to know. I'm ready for Appreciate it, Sosa. But like like I was saying, man, like I was saying, you know, you gotta, you gotta just like think. Because sometimes y'all might think I forgot the whole time I didn't. Yeah! You know what I'm saying? What is your boy? Cut on one. You know what I'm saying? And I'm back at it with another Madden video. You know what I'm saying? That's stuff. That's done. 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 You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all enjoyed the last one. And I hope y'all gonna enjoy this one. And then when y'all enjoy this one, we gonna get into some more. Nah, nah. So yeah, um, I hope that y'all rock with it so far. I rock with it heavy. Uh, I'm gonna change my food. Uh, make more sense. Make more sense. Um, but yeah, uh. Yeah, man, we gonna we gonna hit up these the this thing with the activities and all that. On my speed, stand up. Lock in. Had to lock in, boy. You gotta lock in. If you don't lock in, who are you? You get what I'm saying? If you don't lock in, who are you? You know what I'm saying? That's tough. Make sure you lock in. Everything you do, bro, make sure you lock in, man. Uh, Woo! Where you get 
after him then. Tell me to defense. I need to see this day in and day out. We need to bring this level of intensity to the field. Hey, man. How's it going? You ready to get to work? Did you get a protein shake in you? Of course I did, coach. Come on, now look at me. All right, man. That's good. We got a long day of playbook installs. I want to see everyone at full speed this weekend. Now, all I know is full speed, coach. We're ready to go. All right, good. Walk with me. Greatness cannot be delayed. I want everybody locked in this weekend. I want you flying around the field, making plays like you're a rookie, and your roster spot depends on it. Hey, I got you, coach. You have what it takes to be the best defensive player in the league. Mm. Make it happen. That's what I came for, baby. Six months, championship defense starts today. Let's get it. Let's go. Let's go. Put in the reps. That's it. Just keep it up, boys. Intensity is high. Championship defense. I love it. Oh, yeah. I'm rocking with this. I'm dying already, son. Already. Uh, we're going to say go. I do that once now. And yeah, let's go, man. Man, I'm ready. I don't even want. I don't even want to look at the outside. I'm ready to hit something, bro. Right? Like boom, like that. Like boom. Get the whole head on. Look at. Wow. Welcome to week one of the NFL preseason. Yeah. The Texans defense after a long summer getting ready to go for the first time here in the preseason. And the one to watch is going to be this man, their fifth year linebacker. And even though this. Okay. 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 This is just a preseason game. This is actually an important game for this man. He's on a new team. He's trying to run a new defensive scheme, and it's all being thrown at him fast and furious. But he's the type of guy who can thrive in a situation like this, and I expect him to do just that. And give him six hey. yards here as he stopped near the 35 at the 34. On second down and four, Winston. A hit as he throws there, incomplete. So much of this game is about leverage. We always talk about no man wins in the trenches. Looks like that in just about every position. And sometimes, if you lose that leverage and you're losing the battle, just jump up at the line of scrimmage and try and battle. Boom! And that's exactly what happened there. And he is going to have a Saints first down, and he was able to get it by Plenty, a gain of eight on third and three. They'll go draw here. Winston hands to Camara. And it's a good acceleration there as he's across midfield to the 48-yard line. The Saints first down there on a gain of 11. Jameis to throw it. They'll set up the screen now to Camara. And he is going to lose yardage here. He was unable to shake free there, and they'll cover him for a loss of a yard. Well, Brandon, we could see that play developing, and they were hoping that he was going to be able to put a move on the first guy and turn it into a big play. But no such luck. The speed on defense continues to get better and better in the NFL. Pretty nice example there of those guys being able to run from their assignments and finish up. Going to get on second down, but this time it's incomplete. Seventh play of this drive coming up, but a long way to go on third down. To throw, Winston. And that will be incomplete. That was a nice job yeah, defensively yeah, disguising the coverage and making it difficult for the quarterback to lock in on a receiver, and it results in an incomplete pass. The Texans about ready to go now on defense. They've got the three-nothing advantage here. Is this? 
They start the drive on the ground. Kamara. Room here to run. And they work this well upfield across the 45. 40 yards rushing for him now on just his first three carries. Sometimes those lines that are drawn on a grease board or in a playbook, they come to life <laughs> out on the field, don't they? And we just saw that on that outside handoff to the right. That right tackle, he gets excited for that call, doesn't he? He does, because he just wants to dominate his guy and say, listen, I was the point of attack. I took care of business. That's why you're able to get downfield and add all those yards to your total. Yeah, really nice gain there. On second down, Kamara. And he's going to be close to a first down as the tackle is made at the Texans' 43-yard line. This is third and one. Very likely four down territory, even if they don't get it, though. Here's Kamara trying to run for it. And I don't think Kamara got there. Looks like they stopped him short. Tough sledding. They lose a yard there on third. Now Winston on fourth down. And this is caught. He hits Landry. He will have the conversion and more than that. And a big gain that time. He's out of bounds on what will be the final play of this first quarter. The Saints with the football here to begin quarter number two. As they've got it with a first and ten. It's also my first time playing linebacker. You know, so you gotta cut cut the whistle slack. You know what I'm saying? Cut the whistle slack. All right. They not gonna let me play again, huh? So, Charles, in this a game that certainly had some intrigue, but I think you and I both agree we like the decision to not play overtime in preseason and just call it a draw. Partner, I want to meet the person who disagrees with this decision, and I just wonder what to... Okay, cool. No overtime, no listening, I'm cool with that. Bro, I'm trying to hit somebody so hard, they, they whole body just done. So guess what? That was a little too short. I didn't really get to, you know, do what I wanted to do. So, I'm going to advance. I'm going to advance with him. I'm going to advance with him. You know what I'm saying? Let's see. Okay, I need to see everyone bright and early tomorrow. Hey, I really need you to step it up at practice, okay? Bring your A game tomorrow. Let's see it. Hey, I just want to let you know the entire staff sees the work you've been putting in. Keep taking advantage of the reps you're getting. Hey, let's go. Thanks, coach. I will. Just do yourself a favor. Don't get complacent. Nah, I'm not. I'm just going to keep building my game. There's always another level to be reached, you know? Exactly. Now, we just need you to keep getting better. You have all the physical tools, but we are going to put a lot on you this year. Nah, I'm ready. I came here to win. Good. All camp, we've been preaching disruption and chaos. But there's a discipline to all this, too. In order to play defense like we want to, it requires constant communication on the field and a dedication to learning the concepts off of it. Well, I'm dedicated. 
I'm locked in. I got this playbook with me 24-7. Now that is what I like to see. I just need you to keep it up. The more comfortable you are with our schemes, the better our defense will be for it. And all season, we'll just keep improving. I got you, coach. We'll make it happen today. Okay, let's have a good practice. I don't even, even want to set no goals because I'm trying to achieve everything. Oh, I'm playing it. Wait, they're not playing. It's preseason. Jalen. Jalen. The Texans defense getting prepared to go to work here. On first in, and oh, right away, he lost the football. And the Texans scoop it. And they are going to take over right there at the 22 yard line. No coach or team's ever happy when someone has a turnover, but if there's ever a good time to do it, preseason. Yeah, right <laughs> now. You know that to come regular season, he's going to be ready to go and maybe. The uh, Houston defense back onto the field. They lead 7 0. Trying to put a stop together here as this drive starts with a first down. The fake to Akers. Here's Stafford. Well, that'll be caught by Cup. And he'll be out right at the 35. Right off the bat, it's a first down to start the drive. 12 yards. Doesn't matter whether it's a zone coverage or a man coverage. The drag route can be effective when it's run well. They blitz him. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. A shotgun snap for Stafford. And the coverage terrific there as that's knocked down and incomplete. Oh, I like the calmness of how he played the ball here. No panic in his eyes as that throw arrived. Tracked it from the moment it left the quarterback's hand. And that's just where he needed to be to knock it away. They go with a shuffle pass and it's complete. He'll get only three there, so it leaves him with a third and seven ahead. So seven yards from the first down here as they come up to the line of scrimmage. Throwing again at Stafford. And able to find Higby, it's complete. And he is brought down, but not before reaching the 30. Give him 32 on the play. Stafford going to give this to Akers. A short gain here, maybe a yard to the 29. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. To throw is Stafford. And this one is going to be off the mark, too far out in front. So now here in the second week of the preseason, you'd expect the starters to play a little bit more than they did in week one, but not a whole lot. So if you're an offensive coordinator, what are you looking for? What you're looking for is things getting cleaned up as you go along because most of your playbook's probably installed. How well are they handling it? Easy in and out of the huddle? No mental mistakes? Are they starting to look like a good offensive football team? Gay's kick is good. And they are on the board, but still trailing. It's 7-3. So they are able to end that drive with three points in this one possession ball game. Yeah. And ideally, you want to end every drive with points. Most quarterbacks would tell you, let's end it with a kick, right? A PAT, that's number one. The Texans about ready to go now on defense. And they're playing with a lead here in this first quarter. They'll begin on the ground with Akers. And nothing much materializing there on the first down run. He'll get a couple, and that's it. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. 
Now Stafford. Toward the sideline, and look at that catch. Dragging the toes, and that's going to be a first down. Well done. Yeah, this is going to win, bro. I'm trying to get a big hit. On first and ten, Stafford. That's complete to Robinson. And he's able to take it across midfield before going out of bounds. Here's a run with Akers on second down. Yeah. And a pretty athletic run right there Let's as he's going to get this down yeah. inside the four. Yeah, like it's a Rams first down on a pickup of 10. He still got it, bro. After one, I, I seven, did, three, yeah. the score on EA Sports. The Rams with the football here to begin the second quarter. This offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and ten. Here's Stafford. Oh, going for Jefferson downfield. And that will be caught, but out of the end zone, says the field. Sean McVay unhappy on the sidelines visibly. He's made the decision to reach for the red flag. So not successful there on the challenge, and he'll have to be careful from here on out because he'll only have one challenge remaining. And he'll take this one down to the 36. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. Stafford. Under pressure, and the Texans able to get in there for the sack. Multiple players combined for their team's first sack of the game. And every game we talk about what are going to be the keys as we go into it. Maybe that's a key for their defense. The Houston defense back onto the field. Their guys have the lead here in this first half. They'll try to further the cause on their end as this drive begins first and ten. They'll run on first down with Akers. What? And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. First play of the drive going for 14 and a first down. I don't know what this says about me, but I love successful runs up the middle when the blocking is so well executed like that. And it doesn't matter whether it's zone blocking, whether it's a power scheme. When you have a blocker on a defender and then the running back can read it, find the proper hole and just go, Sometimes a thing of beauty. Now a first down throw. Stafford over the middle. And by Cup. And a little to about the front of the yard line. I think that's a big pickup for the first time because when you have a drag route against zone, you're sometimes asking for trouble because you might run into a defender. Yeah, well, there they ran into a first down, executed it to perfection. On first down at Stafford. They'll set up the screen here to Akers. Gets a run. And they're going to get this down near the 35 yard line. Man, and good yardage there on first down because sometimes all you need to do on the screen is get one key block. That might set your man free, and that was pretty good pursuit to the football defensively, or it could have gone for more. Two minutes to play in this first half. 7-3, our score. Here's second and a yard. Now Stafford. He'll get this into the hands of Van Jefferson. Six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. A little football 101 there. You just see the receiver try to run down the defender, meaning he goes right at him, and really trying to move him a little bit towards the center of the field so he can put his foot in the ground and break to the out, to the sideline, and make a catch. Now here's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. Nice progress down the field. was halted by that incompletion. They could try for some safe yards here to get things moving again or keep throwing it and pushing it downfield to try and pick up bigger yardage. 
a second down pass play there, but it's incomplete. As we thought they might do here in week two of the preseason, they've left their starting quarterback out there for this second quarter, but I would imagine we will not see him after halftime. Yeah, this is the time of year you've got to get your backup some reps and make sure you protect your starting quarterback. Now yet another incompletion here as they fail to connect on third. Fourth down, and we go from one Matt to another. Stafford heads off. Matt Gay gets set for the Rams' field goal. And Gay knocks this one through. And they'll get it back within a point at 7-6. to six. So the margin shrinks a bit as back-to-back -back drives here for him and with field goals. Yeah, we know no one's turning down three, especially in the first half, but you've got to finish these drives in the end zone. That's got to be a priority. Nice to have a reliable kicker, but outside of his agent, you know you'd rather him kick one point. Let's go, yo. We doing good. They ain't score on this yet. The Texans about ready to go now on defense. I just got to learn how to stop begin by trying to defend a first and 10 at the 25-yard uh, line. Getting back there. That's what I'm telling you. They keep getting, they keep getting tight. They keep getting all first down. Oh, that's not good. Stafford on first down. He rifles one that's intercepted. Go, Emo. Doing good so far. I love this. Okay. You and I were excited for this one today, and certainly had its moments. Some good execution at times by both of these offenses. Defenses both made some plays as well. And always a joy to be up here in the booth next to you, my friend. Yeah, it's a privilege to be up here in the booth next to you as well. Thanks for taking the time, and let's go ahead and get ready for our next one. Right? I'll see you in the film room. Get that preparation it. started now. All right, man. You know, let me know how you rock with the with the linebacker. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, 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 bell. and when you're sharing, share it to everybody you know and more. And you know, we gonna get active, man. Just let me know what y'all wanna see. Let me know how y'all want me to do this. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, man, that's tough. Peace.